This game front walkthrough is brought to you by Best Buy. Hey guys, this is Mitchell from Gamefront here to help you out with all of your real estate concerns in the land of Skyrim. Next up is the House of Markarth, Vlindril Hall. Note that you'll need to be level 20 or higher in order for the Jarl to give you the second quest related to obtaining this house. So to start, you're going to need to talk to Jarl Igmund inside Understone Keep in the town of Markarth. The keep is basically located at the back end of the town near the large waterfall. I don't know you, and I don't sell what precious property we have to outsiders. Ask him for work, and he'll send you on a quest to kill the leader of some Forsworn at Red Eagle Redoubt. So set your waypoint for the location, fast travel to the nearest discovered spot, and work your way toward the dungeon. Be careful of several traps along the way. Once the deed is done, return to the Jarl for your reward. I'm impressed. Force One usually makes short work of mercenaries. Head into the hills. You can then talk to his steward for another job. He'll send you off on another murder spree to kill some bandits. Same deal here. The hard part is getting to the place, which honestly, I wish I could help you with, but I kinda just found it on accident after trying to climb a mountain for 20 minutes. Once you complete this task, head back to Rayrek, and then talk to the Jarl again for another quest. I do. A personal matter. My father died trying to negotiate with the Force One. Back when that was possible. They took his shield to those Hargraven beasts they consort with. I need you to bring it home where it belongs. This is a much harder dungeon, so be prepared for the fight. And remember, you have to be level 20 in order for this quest to appear. Things get really tricky right at the end where you reach the location where the shield is stashed. The shield is guarded by a Hagraven who summons two Frost Trolls. What I did was quickly rush to Hagraven and use the tried and true Fus Rodash out. Then I circle around the middle until it recharges and use it again to push at least one of the Frost Trolls off the edge. From there, taking on a single Frost Troll is pretty manageable. Once you get the shield, the hard part is over. Fast travel back to the keep, present the Jarl with the shield, and he'll give you the opportunity to buy a house for 8,000 gold. I hereby grant you permission to purchase property in my city. Talk to my steward if you're interested. As well as his steward. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. Your new home is located right next to Nepo's house. And as you might imagine, it doesn't look very nice. But once again, with a little bit of magic and a lot of gold, your place could look like this. Since you have a house now, you could also complete five miscellaneous quests for the people of Markarth and eventually become a thane of the town. Doing so will grant you the Blade of the Reach, which unfortunately is kind of weak in my opinion, but it still serves as an excellent decoration inside my new display case. Thanks for watching our homeowner's guide for the world of Skyrim, and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.